Hey, guys, Dave McCann, Blaine Fowler from another day of media observation at BYU. First and foremost, we talked to Puka Nakua. We talked to Gunnar Romney. They've kind of had light schedules the last week or two. They both said they're happy, they're healthy, they will be on the field September 3rd. Yeah, so it's two weeks from today that this team will get on a, a flight and head down to South Florida. And so now we start asking questions, is everybody healthy? Is everybody ready to go? And we got a resounding yes. Not only are we healthy, we'll be ready to go. It, it's time to get our legs back under us. And we're really thinking about South Florida at this point. So for the next two weeks, it's game prep time. And Jaron Hall, who's been under the weather, he's here, but, it, but he allowed the uh, backups to get a lot of work in today. But on the other side of the ball with the defensive backs, we talked about just about everybody. And ecstatic was the word that came out of Malik Moore's mouth when we said, hey, how do you feel about your group? Yeah, he, he said, not only are we flying around to the football and making plays, he said, we're really deep. Then he looked at me and said, you've been here a long time. Is there a better, more deep secondary ever in BYU history? And I said, well, <laughs> I have to think back long and hard. Yeah. And I said, the combination of depth at safety and at corner is, is probably unmatched. This team probably has more talent back there than they've ever had. Now you add a brand new guy in Mori Bamba, the JC transfer from Tyler Junior College down in Texas, who just started in camp today. Tons of big bodies that can run and cover. I expect BYU to play a lot of man-to-man -man this year because they're going to be that talented back there. Caleb Hayes came up and said, hey, when are we going to we need to put me on BYU TV? I said, what are you talking about? We featured You're you last all week. all the time. You need to watch. And now we're talking about him right now. Both he and D'Angelo Mandel, who you talked to, there, there's, a, there's an excitement. We're in the middle of the dog days. But these guys can see the end is near because South Florida is around the corner. When you start talking two weeks till we get on the plane, let's go, it just changes that mentality. And when you start game prepping for the teams you're going to play, that changes your preparation. So everybody seems to be excited at practice today. For Blaine Fowler, I'm Dave McCann. That's the word from Cougar Camp.